we're going to give you a preview of the upcoming L release, not just for mobile, but for form factors beyond mobile. We wanted to take a radical new approach to design. What if pixels didn't just have color, but also depth? This led us to a way of thinking that we call material design. We'll now allow app developers to specify an elevation value for any UI surface. And you'll see the, the, the ripple touch effect as I touch each of these tabs. Over the coming summer months, we'll be extending material to all aspects of our apps and the system. Another area where we've improved the user experience on L is around notifications. In L, we give you instant interactive access to notifications right from the lock screen. We've also introduced a new type of notification in L that we call a heads-up notification. All of a sudden, I get a call from Marcelo. So from here, I can keep going, or if I want to act on it, I can answer it. Or if I'm busy, swipe it away. In L, we're introducing a new concept we call personal unlocking. And personal unlocking enables the device to determine if it's in a trusted environment, say in the owner's hand or on the, beside the owner on a table. Personal unlocking uses signals such as locations you de designate, Bluetooth devices that are visible, even your unique voice brand. I currently have a pattern lock on this device, but because I'm wearing a Bluetooth watch, my phone knows it's me who's present, and so it doesn't challenge me with an unlock. We're also making it easy for you to find content using Google Search, whether it's deep in the web or deep in an app. Instead of going to the website, it's actually going to take us to the OpenTable app because Tom happens happens to have the app installed. There's lots of other exper user experience improvements in L. For example, a new keyboard UI, do not disturb mode, new quick settings, and much, much more.